It is time for this week's Sin City Chronicles. Let's start back in 1999. August 28, 1999, Cher performed at the MGM Grand Garden Arena. Cindy Lauper was her opening act, and the show was released on DVD. It was a huge success, becoming certified platinum in four countries. August 29th is Michael Jackson's birthday. The king of pop would have been 63 years old on Sunday. Now, even though Jackson never performed a solo show in town, he still has many connections to Las Vegas. He received a key to the city in 2003, and he eventually leased a home in the area of Rancho in Alta. The Desert Inn opened in 1950, and it closed its doors on August 28, 2000. The hotel was featured in many films, including Ocean's Eleven, Sister Act Two, and Rush Hour Two. The DI's most famous guest was Howard Hughes, who lived in the penthouse suite for four years. WCW Monday Nitro was at the MGM Grand on August 23, 1999. The main event right there, Sting versus Hulk Hogan, and the show ended with a performance from KISS. The band, they were on hand to debut a new character called The Demon. All right, in 1988, the USA men's basketball team participated in an eight-game schedule against a bunch of NBA All-Stars before heading off to the Olympics in Seoul, South Korea. The players for the NBA teams varied by location. We're looking at a game in Charlotte with Michael Jordan. Well, the Olympic team came to the Thomas and Mack on August 27, 1988. And the big name for the NBA that night was, boom, Reggie Theus. There he is, my man. And the NBA team, by the way, Rocky, <laughs> your dad and his fellow NBA players, they won that night. Of course they did. Oh, look at him go. Look at him go. <laughs> He's got skills. I love I it. I love that. That's Hi, really your mom cool. and dad. I know they're watching. Oh, they love you, JC. That's your <laughs> Sin City Chronicles for the last week of August. Take it so away, Rocky. Good, as always. All right, coming up.